Our first film is Caught in Paint, an award-winning documentary film that's been shown in 37 film festivals throughout the country. Caught in Paint captures the collaboration between painter-sculptor Rita Blitt and New York City's Parsons Dance Company. Rita Blitt has been creating art for over 60 years. Her works range from pastel drawings and bold flowing black lines to sculpture that towers 60 feet tall. Rita's art has been exhibited and collected all over the world. Look for her exhibit in 2006 starting September 12th at the Jacqueline Casey Hudgens Center for the Arts in Duluth, Georgia. Rita Blitz's paintings and sculpture will occupy the entire museum and sculpture garden. The Parsons Dance Company, founded by David Parsons, is well known for its large repertory of original modern dance works, as well as for their solid commitment to education through community-based outreach programs that include workshops and master classes. The company conducts extensive statewide tours around the country and has been featured in many television programs internationally and even performed in New York City's Times Square on New Year's Eve in 2000. I am drawing and painting the music. I am dancing. And I'm having a wonderful time <laughs> dancing. I was preparing for my coming exhibit of paintings and sculpture. David was visiting, and he coincidentally had his Lois Greenfield photographs on the table right next to my paintings. And we looked at them and it was just so obvious the energy was the same. David said, why don't we do something new? Why don't you come to New York and we'll do something new? And one, two, three, do it. We had this wonderful idea of my painting on mylar and then I could remove that painting and do another and another, and another, and another. And the dancers would dance behind the painting, and Lois would photograph the experience. Maybe keep curvy to match the uh, calligraphy. Just a little lower, so that your head is gonna be in that swirl. Okay. The dancers started to respond behind my painting. David and Lois started telling them what to do, and I think everybody was feeling their way because they hadn't arrived where they ultimately were, that all the shots would be only when the dancers had their legs totally up in the air, off the ground, and within my painting. Three, do it. Two more and you're done. Back arm, click the heels. Relax, the wind's taking you. Shoulders relaxed. One, two, three, do it. David started as a gymnast before he got into modern dance. His work is very energetic and honest. There is this incredible vitality and flowing line. I identify with his work very much. Do it, stay away, stay alive. That's nice. I feel very close to David and to the company. I really did not meet Lois until this collaboration. I'd like to work on the ambiguity of the It was quite a shock to find out that we had so much in common. I want to build up slowly. Okay. Yeah. Okay. A one, two. I think we both love to work spontaneously and we both love to experiment. I put myself in front of the surface on which I'm going to paint. And I very often close my eyes. And when I am ready, I attack. Go ahead, Rita.
David shaped and refined the movements of the dancers. And then Lois centered them, and that's when the photograph evolved Sorry. with the dancers partially hidden behind the center. Oh, here it is. You have something open. Yeah. Oh, oh, woo! This is great. Oh. Mozart. Oh, <laughs> my God. Brava, brava. That's so religious. Rita, come on in here. This is great. It's very religious. Look at that. And the light's fabulous. That is oh. cool. Yes, and what I came up with a good idea. How do you get coffee? Look at this. Look how the hair and the... Uh, For more information, visit www.readablit.com.